Pugs often are described as a lot of dog in a small space. These sturdy, compact dogs are a part of the American Kennel Club's toy group, and are known as the clowns of the canine world because they have a great sense of humor and like to show off. Originally bred to be a lap dog, the pug thrives on human companionship. The pug's comical face, with deep wrinkles around big, dark eyes and a flat round face, can't help but make you smile. It is believed that the pug's name comes from the Latin word for fist because his face resembles a human fist. Pugs are clowns at heart, but they carry themselves with dignity. Pugs are playful dogs, ready and able for games, but they are also lovers, and must be close to their humans. Pugs love to be the center of attention, and are heartsick if ignored. Pugs are square and thick set, usually weighing no more than 20 pounds. Their heads are large and round, with large, round eyes. They have deep and distinct wrinkles on their faces. Legend has it that the Chinese, who mastered the breeding of this dog, prized these wrinkles because they resembled good luck symbols in their language. Especially prized were dogs with wrinkles that seemed to form the letters for the word prince in Chinese. Size Pugs weigh between 14 and 18 pounds, male and female. Generally, they are 10 to 14 inches tall at the shoulder. Personality Don't expect a pug to hunt, guard or retrieve. Pugs were bred to be companions, and that's exactly what they do best. The pug craves affection in your lap and is very unhappy if his devotion isn't reciprocated. He tends to be a sedentary dog, content to sit in your lap as you read a book or watch a movie. This doesn't mean the pug is a stick in the mud. Au contraire. He is a playful, comical dog that enjoys living it up, and delights his owner with silly antics. Temperament is affected by a number of factors, including heredity, training, and socialization. Puppies with nice temperaments are curious and playful, willing to approach people and be held by them. Choose the middle of the road puppy, not the one who's beating up his littermates or the one who's hiding in the corner. Always meet at least one of the parents usually the mother is the one who's available to ensure that they have nice temperaments that you are comfortable with. Meeting siblings or other relatives of the parents is also helpful for evaluating what a puppy will be like when he grows up. Like every dog, the pug needs early socialization exposure to many different people, sights, sounds, and experiences when they're young. Socialization helps ensure that your pug puppy grows up to be a well-rounded dog. Enrolling him in a puppy kindergarten class is a great start. Inviting visitors over regularly, and taking him to busy parks, stores that allow dogs, and on leisurely strolls to meet neighbors will also help him polish his social skills. Health Pugs are generally healthy, but like all breeds, they're prone to certain health conditions. Not all pugs will get any OR all of these diseases, but it's important to be aware of them if you are considering this breed. If you're buying a puppy, find a good breeder who will show you health clearances for both your puppy's parents. Health clearances prove that a dog has been tested for and cleared of a particular condition. In pugs, you should expect to see health clearances from the Orthopedic Foundation for Animals, OFA, for hip dysplasia, with a score of fair or better elbow dysplasia, hypothyroidism, and von Willebrand's disease, from Auburn University for thrombopathia, and from the Canine Eye Registry Foundation, SURF, certifying that eyes are normal. Care Though playful and rambunctious, the pug is a low-maintenance companion, making it ideal for older owners. Because they are a small, quiet breed and are relatively inactive when indoors, they are a good choice for apartment dwellers as well. Their compact package belies a great deal of energy, so expect to be entertained with some goofy antics if your pug doesn't get a walk or some playtime. They are sensitive to heat and humidity, however, so if you live in a hot or humid environment, be sure your pug doesn't spend too much time outside. Light sleepers may also want to invest in a pair of ear plugs pugs are prone to snore. Feeding Recommended daily amount one half to one cup of high quality dry food a day, divided into two meals. Note, how much your adult dog eats depends on his size, age, build, metabolism, and activity level. 
Dogs are individuals, just like people, and they don't all need the same amount of food. It almost goes without saying that a highly active dog will need more than a couch potato dog. The quality of dog food you buy also makes a difference the better the dog food, the further it will go toward nourishing your dog and the less of it you'll need to shake into your dog's bowl. While the pook's first love is human attention, his second love is food. These dogs love to eat, eat, eat. This, combined with their small stature, puts them at risk for obesity. As a pug owner, you must show great restraint. Do not indulge him with food. Feed appropriate portions, limit treats and encourage exercise. Coat color and grooming. Even though the coats are short, pugs are a double-coated breed. Pugs are typically fawn-colored or black. The fawn color can have different tints, such as apricot or silver, and all pugs have a short, flat, black muzzle. The coat is short and smooth, but don't be deceived. Pugs shed like crazy, especially in summer. The wise pug owner accepts this, and adjusts her wardrobe accordingly, wearing light-colored clothing that better hides hair. Following that, regular brushing and bathing helps keep the coat in good condition and shedding to a minimum. A monthly bath is sufficient, though some owners bathe their pugs more frequently. The pook's small size is handy, you can drop him right in the kitchen or utility sink for a bath. Regular nail trimming is essential, since these house dogs don't usually wear down their nails outdoors like active breeds do. It's a good idea to clean the pook's ears every few weeks, as well. What requires special attention is the pook's facial wrinkles. These folds are hotbeds for infection if allowed to become damp or dirty. The wrinkles must be dried thoroughly after bathing, and wiped out in between baths. Some owners simply use a dry cotton ball, others use commercial baby wipes to wipe out the folds. Children and other pets. Pugs love kids. Though small, the pug is not delicate like some toy breeds, so he is a good breed choice for families with children. However, children who want an active pet to retrieve balls or play soccer will be disappointed with a pug. Adults should always supervise interactions between children and pets. Properly trained and socialized, the pug enjoys the companionship of dogs, and can be trusted with cats, rabbits, and other animals. Rescue Groups Pugs are often purchased without any clear understanding of what goes into owning one. There are many pugs in need of adoption and or fostering. There are a number of rescues that we have not listed. If you don't see a rescue listed for your area, contact the National Breed Club or a local breed club and they can point you toward a pug rescue.